Something a little bit different on the channel today. I thought I'd give you guys a sneak peek of some of the stuff I've been working on. Down in the basement, this is a Raspberry Pi portable gaming center I've been working on. Check this out. This is a portable projector I got. You saw it in a mailbag a while back. It works really awesome. I've been checking it out on my big 110 inch screen. It seems to be working pretty good. I think that'll be a good project. And here, very cool thing arrived. Check this out. This is a Power Wheels kids toy and I'm going to turn it into a four wheel, well not four wheel drive, a, a Mars Rover, Raspberry Pi powered. I am super happy with this. Uh, gotta get it out of the box and you'll see that on a mailbag video, but I think we'll chop the head, get rid of the handlebar system, no kids stickers and stuff, and this should make a pretty fun little robot chassis. Look at this, this is craziness. This is my mailbag shelf, guys. This is all items waiting for a mailbag to be done. So I think this afternoon would be a good day to do that. Wi-Fi range extenders, Amazon Alexa dots, all kinds of cool stuff. Should be pretty fun. A couple other projects down there as well. But yeah, this is where I keep kind of all the projects on the go. This is another one I owe a video on. Uh, this is my... Um, home security system using a Wemos D1 Mini and it works perfectly. I'm so happy with it. So uh, I think we need, once I get the new 3D printer, we'll move that into its own project case and it should be a little bit of fun. Over here, check this out. This is something you haven't seen on the channel before. Any of you guys want to see some airsoft stuff? I have... Um, this rifle that I've been working on to convert over to a uh, Raspberry Pi Zero powered uh, airsoft. Eh, could be fun. Let me know if you guys are interested. And not much going on over here. This, my airsoft helmet that I got. I've been working on the four wheel drive uh, robot a little bit because I'm using the code from this in that big rover you just saw a few minutes ago. So that should be pretty fun as well. This is uh, another thing I was working on this weekend, my robot arm. For you, those of you who have been around on the channel for a long time, you might remember this. I have a little bit of a tune-up to do. Unfortunately, some of the, uh, the tendons have stretched and the way I fastened them was not good up here, so it's very difficult to tension them. But uh, I don't know, it should be fun. I got an idea for a couple of projects on that. That's the workbench up here. That's the live streaming setup. You guys who have joined me on my weekly live shows where I'm building quadcopters and stuff, that's where it comes from. Lots of Arduinos and goodies there, but no new projects. This, I think I might incorporate right onto that robot because I'm gonna be remotely accessing the pies that run it. I think I'm going to need a permanent screen. And here's something else you haven't seen on the channel yet, a ultrasonic cleaner. Uh, works awesome for electronics repair, so I got a video coming on that at some point too. We'll go back up to the office and round things out. Check this out. This is some code I've been working on. I worked on through the night last night. This is what's running uh, Wemos D1 Mini, and uh, I'll show you that in a minute. This is a uh, allowing me to control it via the Amazon Alexa, which is pretty cool. This is where I talk to you guys. Uh, link down in the description below. This is our Discord chat room where it's free. You can join in and chat with anybody in the community. And then I've got Tech Live running in the background, which is uh, the Twit Netcast network, which is pretty cool. You got Leo Laporte running all day. This is a 3D printer that I'm about to change out uh, this week. New one should be here. Should be a new Raspberry Pi Magpie magazine here this week too. And over here is the quads that you've seen me working on. This is the Red October build that we did live and then my other, my 210s and my 225s and some micro quads, which uh, I don't know whether the video of this will be live already or not, but yeah, lots of fun stuff going on. You guys have seen this kitchen pie set up before. Uh, I did full assembly video and stuff on it, but recently I just went ahead and got the Amazon Echo Dots. And this is what I've got working with them. This is, this is the result of that code you saw on the computer. If we go ahead and plug this in, no sign of life. This is the, the Wemos D1 Mini microcontroller. But if we go ahead and activate it, 
Alexa, turn on light one. Okay. Alexa, turn off light one. Okay. Perfect. See the LED change state? Now we can hook whatever we want to this. I'll do a full video tutorial on this coming up. That is it for the projects on the go this week. Hope you guys enjoyed this behind the scenes kind of video. It's a little bit of an area I haven't showed you guys before. Subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Hit that thumbs up button. It really, really helps the videos. It really helps the channel, guys. Lots more content coming. Stay tuned. It's going to be a fun winter this year. Lots of projects.